In 2023, I traveled thousands of miles magnet fishing in my boat. This video combines five days that I spent magnet fishing along a river walk in Green Bay, Wisconsin. Grab your snacks, kick back, and enjoy the video. What is going on today, guys? Hopefully you can still hear me good over the boat motor, but today, obviously you can tell we are back out on the boat and we are gonna be doing some more magnet fishing. Now I'm headed to a brand new spot right now. You guys know I love hitting new spots. You just never know what the heck you're gonna find. It is absolutely gorgeous out here today, guys. I'm in a short sleeve shirt. We got like 75 degrees today. All right, guys, so we are gonna head up the river. We're gonna find us a spot to make the fish and we're gonna see if we can find anything here today all right guys today we are back out on the boat it is absolutely gorgeous out here today i have my large 360 degree magnet with me and today we're gonna be magnet fishing at a brand new spot that i've never hit before this area is looking super juicy you guys there's a big old river walk over here there is no telling what we're gonna find let's get right down to it here today start tossing this magnet around and see if we can find anything Oh, look at that, you guys. Holy cow, it's been like 10 throws. I wasn't even expecting anything, and I definitely didn't even feel that. But check it out, first find of the day. Oh, and of course, the hook is broke. We got the old broken eyeball jig. Oh, I just clung on to something right there. Hold on, buddy. Stay on there. Oh, yeah, we got something here, guys. If I can get it to come up, hopefully. Yeah, here we go. It's, it's coming. What is this one? From the depths down below. Seriously, it is so deep here. I got to check the depth finder. I want to know how deep it is. Here we go. The heck we got there the old three tentacle crab leg seriously what the heck is that looks like the old snow crab legs looks like just three pipes put into one finger huh the old three pipe something why is this trolling motor like dead man why is it like not charged i don't get it i don't get you What is that? Is that actually moving? Oh, it kind of is. Hold on a second. I thought we were just stuck. Uh-oh, I gotta steer us. Steer us. Yeah, I got something on here, dude. Ah, uh, here we go. The first like actual big thing here, if I can get it up. It's so dark under here with my sunglasses on, I can't see nothing. The heck do we got? Is this just some, what the heck is this? Oh, hold on a second, you guys. At first I thought this was just like a sign pole with nothing on there. Look at this one, you guys. I'm pretty sure this is a sign post, obviously, because look at what that is. It looks like part of a sign. What the heck would this sign have been? That's a weird one. I don't know what the heck this sign was, you guys, but it sure looks old, holy cow. Hold on, nice and slow. Oh my gosh, is that gonna come up? No. Heck no, dude, why would it? Why would it? Uh -oh. oh, I just, what the heck is that, yo? I just like plucked something up out of something. Oh, what the heck this is? Whoa. Whoa, look at that one, you guys, that. Wait, wait a minute. 
I was gonna say, that's definitely a rim, and it sure looks like it, but what the heck are these little uh, bolt-looking pieces there? Or not the bolt pieces, but the bracket-type deal. I don't know, you guys. I would've thought for sure this was some kind of rim, but once you see those little uh, bracket pieces there, I don't know what this could be. It looks like it would mount onto something now. That one's kind of weird. Come on, Buster. You don't gotta do that to me. Oh, again, I just pluck something up out of the mud. I love that feeling. You can just feel it. It just pops right out of the mud, you guys. What the heck do we got this time? Again, some nice weight on there. Ooh, hold on. Wash her off a little bit. The heck do we got here, you guys? check that one out again it almost looks like some kind of maybe not a rim but like some kind of wheel hub i don't know exactly what to think of this one guys but it looks like there's a hole in there like maybe some kind of shaft would have went through there all right you guys now i think we're stumbling onto a pile of stuff let's keep tossing see what else we can find I think I'm hitting on some stuff down there. Come on, something's got a stick, ain't it? Yes, yeah, sir. Or maybe not, I can't really tell, actually. If it is, there's not much on there, I don't think. Oh yeah, there is something on there. Oh, look at that, whoa! Whoa, what is going on here? First of all, this is definitely just some kind of bolt or something, but look at this thing. Oh, I thought this was, part of it i don't know what that is i thought that was like a master lock or something but uh no i don't know what that could be and then i thought it was attached to this thing look at this you guys the old boing boinger what do you think that one came off of well it's not that big so it definitely didn't come off of like a truck or a car i don't think but it's a little bit too big to be like a chair spring or something boing boing Something there. What is this one? Come on, come up, come up, come up, come up. I can feel it stuck in the mud, come on. I got it, here it comes. <laughs> yup, we got that one out of the mud, you guys. What is this? Oh, everything here is just stuck in the mud. Ooh, this one's like twirling coming up. Whoa, that's acting really weird, whoa. What the heck is that? Whoa, whoa. <laughs> Whoa, what is that? You guys, is that, a, is that some kind of cross? Look at that. The closer I look at this thing here, it looks like there are some bolts right here. Who knows? Um. Oh, I grabbed something right here, dude. I was playing with that for a minute. I could not get it, and I, don't, I still don't think it's on there very good. What the heck is this? Uh, oh, what is that, yo? Some kind of, is that a bag? What the heck is this? First of all, I think this is just an ugly piece of rebar, of course. But check this thing out, you guys. What is this? Is that a bag? Oh my gosh, dude. <laughs> I'm pretty sure these are shorts. Yeah, look at you can see the little uh, tie on there. What in the world, you guys? We caught us a pair of shorts. Well, at least they're just a pair of shorts and the legs didn't come with them. That'd be a little spooky. Oh, look it. It's got the liner on the inside, so this is a swimming suit. Doing a little skinny dipping, huh? The 
heck is going on down there? Oh my gosh, I already got something. That was weird. I was like, as soon as it hit the ground, I was bouncing over some stuff and then it clicked. What do we got this time? Oh. Dude, no way, you guys. Is that another one of them exact same type of wheel hub things we found? Yeah, right here, you guys. That is literally the exact same thing. Now, we got two of these suckers. What do you think those are? Do they maybe go together to make some kind of wheel? I don't know, man. Huh. Oh, I thought there was something on there. I couldn't really tell. What the heck is this one here? Smushed up something. And actually, the closer I look, that looks like maybe the handle off of a knife or something. I can't really tell. But check this one out, you guys. We caught us some kind of sprocket looking piece. Definitely got some teeth on there. Who knows what this one was for. It almost looks a little too heavy duty to have come off a bike or something. Who knows what that one could have came off of? Maybe a machine or something? And unless I do a little bit of research, really there is no telling what used to go on on the shores back in the day here. There could have been all kinds of factories here. Who knows? All right, you guys, pretty cool. We got us the old toothy gear piece. Oh, right here. I got something. Oh, ho, ho, buddy. That's heavy, dude. Like, that's really heavy. This, I want to say, is the heaviest thing we had on all day. I'm not even kidding. Holy cow. That's got some weight. What is this? Ooh. Whoa. Whoa. Hold on a second. Whoa. It gets even crazier, dude. No. Oh, something fell off. I'm pretty sure what I seen fall off looked like a, a rubber tire off of a bike. But check this thing out, dude. What the heck do you think that is? Um, I don't even know, man. Oh, no way. The way those blades are all twisted up in there, this kind of looks like an old school lawnmower. Like the push mower where these blades here would basically turn and spin and that's what would cut your grass, you guys. I think that's what that might be. Holy cow, man. That is super cool, you guys. We caught us the old manual lawnmower. What do you think the year on that sucker is? Look at all the clams on there. That one's been down there for a while. That feels weird. That feels like some weight, but I did not feel that click. Why does that is just the weirdest feeling. Again, it could be like a pair of shorts or something where you feel some weight, but it's not magnetic. Or maybe it is magnetic. Heck yeah, this one is. Whoa, look at that. Oh, you know what this piece is? This is like the wheel well part of a bike. I don't know what you would call that, but the wheel attaches right here. I'm sure there's got to be a couple bikes in here, you guys. Whatever bike this came off of, that sucker's got to be about 100 years old. Sheesh. I think we're pulling something, you guys. Kind of in the same area we just found that lawnmower. The old push mower. The heck do we got there? Whoa, oh, wait a minute, hold on, you guys. First of all, what the heck is that? It's a mini sword, it's a dagger. Look at that thing. I don't know what to think of that, dude, but uh, if you go swimming, you definitely don't want to land on that sucker. I know that much. But you guys, we literally caught us another gear looking piece. And I want to say this one almost looks the exact same size. 
Yeah, right here. Oh, maybe not. Okay, so the one we just caught is actually way thicker than this one. Huh, what the heck do you guys think these are coming off of? Oh, no way. Look at who it is, you guys. A little better Frankie. What you doing down there, guy? Come on. Something there. Yeah, we like hardly grabbed that one. But that feels pretty heavy. Huh, what is going on here? Oh, 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 hold on. Oh, what is going on there? Um, dude, holy cow, you guys. Look at, oh my gosh, we're gonna crash at like a thousand miles an hour. Yeah, that's gonna hurt. Oh, we saved her. You guys, look at, we caught literally, it's like a piece of wood with what looks like a railroad spike through there. That's pretty funky, you guys. We caught a spike through the wood. And there was a little something else on here. Look at this one. That is definitely the old wagon wheel. You can still see part of the spokes on there and everything, you guys. Suck something up out of the mud there. The heck is that? Ooh. Whoa, what is this, you guys? What the heck is this thing? <laughs> Look at that, it looks like some kind of canister. I don't know what to think of this thing, you guys. It almost looks like there's some kind of lid on here that if it wasn't rusted, you could maybe unscrew it or take that off. I don't know, but then there's like some kind of pole going in there and I really don't know what to think of this thing now. What the heck do you guys think that one is? Some kind of funky looking canister. You guys, of course my GoPro wasn't recording. I figured out what the problem is too. It's this battery right here. I don't know what it is, but it's something with this battery and it, it's my camera like shorts out every time I use this one. So we're done with this battery here, junk. Anyways, you guys, check out what I just caught that apparently I didn't even get on film. At first glance, this looks like just some kind of pipe or maybe a big long piece of rebar. But if you look closer at the tip of this thing, that is definitely like some kind of pry bar tip and if you look at the shaft, this is like a hexagon shaped shaft. Like 100% you guys. And this end is actually pointy. It's like just a pointy tip on this one. But yeah, look at that shaft. That is 100% the old hexagon shaft. And the only other places that I've found stuff similar to this has been at railroads. Super cool. And again, some more railroad evidence. You guys, look at how full we have this cart just from magnet fishing, literally in like this little corner here. I got something here. Holy cow, man, there is so much stuff in here. Oh my gosh, you guys, look at, I didn't even think there was anything on there. Just your old stinky piece of rebar. I wasn't even gonna tell you about that one. But look at, it looks like this is, yeah, dude, it is. Holy old fishing lure, man. You can hardly even see the eyeball under there. And definitely no hooks left on that sucker. Super cool, you guys. <laughs> What is that? Something here. Can we get it to come up? Uh-oh. 
Is it coming? It is. Oh, that's what we got here, you guys. Another something plucked up out of the mud. There's got to be just tons of stuff down there sitting in the mud, man. Whoa. What is that? Dude, whoa. whoa. Hold on a second. Let me get this off of here. Oh, no. You guys, I was just trying to bang some of the rust off of there. And look at this thing fell into pieces. This thing is pretty cool, though. What do you think that is? Is that, again, maybe some kind of cart? wheel or is that like an old i don't think that's like an old steering wheel we are finding so much stuff just stuck in the mud in this little area this is crazy man look at the cart is full oh what is that i was just about to throw again what the heck is that oh wait no dude look at this you guys this had to have fallen off of something is that magnetic just hardly look it we must have caught this and i didn't even see it it's a cassette you guys look at you can see some of the film or whatever you call that falling out of there the old cassette tape what the heck you think's on there man wow these things are like ancient Oh, bucko, I see some bubbles. Oh, yeah, we got something heavy. What is this? Ooh, that's really heavy. Oh, my gosh. What the heck is this? Why is it got to be so deep here? Ooh, whoa. Oh, oh, is there something on there? You guys, look at Holy big old chain piece. Oh, nothing on the end of it, man. But holy cow, you guys, look at that massive old chain link piece. Wait, wait a second. Do we have two different pieces? We do. Look at, we got one piece here that's got a hook on the end. This is actually kind of a smaller piece compared to this one here. Only this one, I don't see any hooks on either end. What the heck do you think's going on with the chains down here, you guys? Check that out. Holy cow, man. something there oh now he just really connected heck yeah and here she comes this one's mine bucko what do we got what do we got oh hold on a second hold on a second i got you whoa you guys what the heck do we got here whoa is that some kind of Oh, it's some kind of box. Hold on a second. What the heck is going on here? First of all, you guys, before we look at that big box, what is that? Uh, doesn't look like much. Something with a something on there. Just the old scrap looking piece on that one. But look at this, you guys. That is definitely a lock. And looking at that puppy, man, that's gotta be old. But you guys, this box, what the heck? is this it almost looks like there's a little some kind of trap door on there but that doesn't really want to open and then if you look on the inside that trap door is like right here so it would like open up i don't know you guys that is a weird looking one couple holes in the side i've definitely never seen anything like this we cost the old mystery box with the clams on there unreal you guys just like that we filled our cart all the way to the top with some pretty cool stuff and almost all of it came from this little corner section here so i can't imagine what else we're gonna find if we go more down river or up river there's just gotta be tons in here cash money
What is going on today, guys? As you can tell, we are down by the boat launch. We already put the boat in the water, and today we are going to be doing some more magnet fishing. Alex is out here with me today. If you would like to check out his channel, I will leave a link down in the description. Now, today we're kind of dodging some storms, you guys. It was literally sprinkling on the way over here. And if you look at this parking lot, there is literally nobody here. There's three trucks, and I'm one of them. So hopefully, fingers cross man we do not get wet today we're not gonna waste any time we're gonna buzz down the river and we're gonna see if we can find anything here today all right guys we are back out here on the boat today i have my large 360 degree magnet with me and from where i'm standing it's kind of hard to tell but just above this wall there's a giant strip mall we are right in the heart of this city there's tons of stores tons of bars there's restaurants there's apartments you name it but we're gonna start dipping the magnet around here we're gonna just float down river and we're gonna see what we can find here today now it is sprinkling right now you guys there's dark clouds rolling in so i'm gonna have a hard time trying to keep the sprinkles off of my camera but i'm gonna do my best You're dragging something? I got something too. I spotted this little corner over here. I figured it might be juicy just looking at it. Ooh, I do got something. What the heck is that? Ah, uh, it doesn't look like nothing too fancy, you guys. My first find of the day. Is this here? Heck yeah, dude. I think what do you this got? is like a monkey wrench or something. What? And a super, super old one at that. Oh, yeah, dude. It's kind of hard to tell. You aren't kidding. That, rust, that is that's... definitely yeah, a wrench, man. For sure. You would adjust it there. Yeah, that's nice kind of find, dude. Like a plumbing wrench, man. Yeah, or right? Or no kidding. First find of the day for me, you guys. Definitely nothing too fancy. Looks like just the old bridge bracket or something. Nothing too fancy. A little bit of scrap metal cash money. Ooh, I just grabbed something up. Heck yeah. That's what I got here, you guys. What is this one? Again, looks like just another scrap piece, but whoa, look at that one, man. There's like some bumpy arrows on the bottom. What the heck? What the heck do you guys think that thing came off of? Pretty much looks like just a chunk of scrap metal, but there's like some, I don't even know. There's like bumped up arrows on there. Oh, I grabbed something there. Yep, I'm pulling something. We are awfully close to this wall, though. What the heck is that? Oh, hey, look at <laughs> Check it out, you guys. We caused the old master lock. Look at that one. That's just a teeny tiny one. That's for like your diary or something. And it still looks pretty fresh, really. Huh, pretty cool, you guys. I wonder what the heck that thing was locking up. And we also have this thing on there. I don't know what the heck you want to think of this clam kebab looking piece. But it's got a hole on the end here. Kind of looks like some kind of bracket type deal. Who the heck knows? The old scrap pipe. Oh, it's a bike peg. Look at that, bro. What is that? I think this is a bike peg. Like oh, it a, a is. BMX bike. Yeah, a neon green yes, one. Sir. Look at that sucker. That color held up pretty nice, bro. The old bike okay. peg. Super cool, dude. For sure, man. Holy cow. <laughs> That's cool looking. I think it's the front end of a shopping like cart. Like a dolly or something? Or it could be a dolly. Yeah, they look man. pretty close together. Oh, or maybe it is a shopping it, cart. I don't know. Like, I, I'm, I think it's a slip something. Yo, something with I the wheels on know, there. Yeah. And there's <laughs> I got a couple <laughs> nibbles. <laughs> I 
I'm feeling on something here. Oh my gosh. Whoa, 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 whoa. No, that's not gonna come up. Dude, what the? No, no. Oh no, I got it again. Here it comes, dude. I gotta lift it super slow. Nope, it's slipping. Yo, what is this? Nice and slow. Nice and slow. You might have to steer us. Dude, what the heck, yo? Oh my gosh, this is actually coming up. I'm not even kidding. It's close. <gasps> yo, it's like a container. Really? I got it. I got it. Oh no. It smells like it smells like what it looks like. Oh, dude, no. Look, is that a toilet? Shut up. Is it? That's insane. She called oh, me the outhouse toilet. <laughs> you gotta be dude, kidding me. Really this not what we're clicking on down there is a metal outhouse. Smell my oh, hand. So good. Dude, so it good. smells like yeah, it. Good. You guys, honestly, I don't know what to think of this. It smells like a toilet. It kind of looks like the base of a toilet, but really, I don't know what that could be. That is super crazy looking though, that's for sure. And that is heavy. I don't know, man. <laughs> Oh, there's a stuck something right here. Heck yeah, you guys, right off the old river walk. Oh, time to wipe the camera. Got to get her nice and clean now. It's time to be able to see. I got something here. Uh-oh, we got to watch where we're going, too. What the heck is that? Really? What is that, just a... Oh, it's a river snake. Uh-oh. <laughs> you guys, I'm pretty sure it's just a big old ugly piece of rebar or something. There sure is a lot of scrap in this river. Holy smokes. Dude, it's like they're getting bigger. These water droplets are getting bigger, man. I don't know how much longer. Oh, dude, if it gets... Yeah, this is getting bad. Look at it. Holy cow. And then when it gets really bad and then we're stuck under the bridge for three hours, then what are we gonna do? Dude, it is so wet. I just wanna hide. <laughs> Where can I hide? <laughs> this is crazy. Oh, I just stuck something real good. Come here. Stay on there. Uh, is this another toilet or what? Dude, oh my gosh. Seriously, this is heavy. Oh, here it comes. I just plucked her up out of the mud. Yep, here we go. Now I caught the shower this time. Or the bathroom sink. <laughs> Seriously, this is heavy, man. Oh my goodness. Whoa, whoa. X marks the spot, dude. What is that, you guys? I have no clue, but you can see it's flat here and here like it would sit kind of like this somehow. Again, maybe just some kind of construction, big old framing piece, I'm not really sure. Whatever this thing is, it's been down there forever. X marks the spot. Whoa, wait a minute. You might not be kidding. Yeah, that doesn't look like a regular piece of rebar when you look at the tip of it. You know what that looks That's like? Hard. That looks like the tip of um, one of them garbage picker upper pokers. Oh, sure. You know what yeah, I'm talking right. about? Yeah, absolutely. Man. Look at the tip of that thing, you guys. I swear, the tip of that looks like the end of a garbage poker, like a picker upper. I'm sure. That's pretty crazy. Or the old fishing spear from back in the day. Who knows? Oh, something here, dude. Oh, I pulled that right out of the mud. What's well, this one? Oh, hold on. We got water all over the camera. All right, what do we got here? Oh, this sucker is beefy. She's beefy. 
Oh, dude. Whoa. Look at that sucker. That's got to be a wheel, huh? What do you think that one came off of? All right, you guys. Some kind of old school steel wheel. <laughs> I keep clicking stuff, but I bet you it's just a matter of wiggling, wiggling some of that stuff out of the mud. Come here, like right here. I feel something. Come on. Wiggle out. Wiggle out. Oh, it's coming loose. It's coming loose. Come on, you goose. No. Come on. Oh, I'm back on it. Come on, I'm gonna go like this. Wiggle it, wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. It worked. Oh, it yup, here it comes. I swear to you. Check my camera. We gotta clear the water spots, of course. What is this? That sucker took a little bit of work. Whoa. Whoa. Hey, dude, this looks like another one of them. Uh, push mower blades. Look at this thing, man. The last time I was out here, I found part of what I thought looked like one of them old school push lawn mowers. You push that sucker and this is the part that spins and cuts the grass. Now that is cool, man. You really just never know what the heck you're gonna find. We found part of a toilet. We got the old push mower blade. What the heck's next? Something here. Again, I'm gonna see if I can wiggle this sucker out of the mud. The old wiggle maneuver takes a little finesse. I got it, I swear, it works every time, dude. Here we go, ha ha ha, I love it, I love it. Ooh, whoa, look at this big old panel looking piece. What the heck do you guys think that thing came off of? Look at that, you can see some hinges down here at the bottom, kind of. Oh, and then like this here might be the handle off of a little flap door. That's kind of crazy. What do you guys think that thing came off of? I don't know what to think of that, man. I would almost be willing to bet if I chip some of the rust off and clean this up, maybe there's some words or some writing on here that we might be able to tell better what the heck this is. Pretty cool. Look at this thing, you See guys. That latch there would kind of pivot, I think. Oh um, yeah, like some hinges or yeah. some kind of latch over I there. Know, what the heck do you think that is? Down on something. There is some faint. Oh, there writing is writing on, on there. Yeah. yeah. But good luck reading that. I don't know. Huh. I can't make that out. Now we got the other half of our bike, okay? so the other side, I should say. Oh, I sucked something. Yep, here we go. Everything, you can just feel it, seriously, you just pluck right out of the mud. What do I got here? Oh, ooh, dude, ooh, the everything handle and everything. You're like known for that. That's, That's awesome. crazy. You guys, I found me a whole flathead shovel and it's rare that I ever find a shovel that still has the whole handle intact. Yeah, sure, Look at that sucker. It's like hardly even chipped up or anything. Super cool, man. We cost the old digger. Oh, I pulled something out of the mud. Dude, I cannot tell you how many times that little wiggle maneuver works. Like every time. Here we go. Another, when you pluck something out of the mud, you know it's gonna be juicy because it's been down there for a long time. Here we go. Dude, is this another wheel? Oh, wait a minute. Is this maybe not a wheel? Look at, you can see gears on there. There's definitely little teeth on there, but it's 
almost looks like that other wheel that we caught or the other rim. Do you guys think this one has something to do with the other one that we caught or is this something totally different? We are finding some really cool old looking stuff today. And you guys look at this cart already. You got some? Oh yeah, he says. Oh, hey. that's certainly a wheel, bro. Like that's like, yeah. Cart. It's smaller than what we thought was your train wheel. All, all of these that. are different. That one's different than the both of the two this that I found. Like, a, like gears. I know, this there. one's got gears, but the other one I found didn't. Well, I did have the boat wiped down before today. Doesn't look like it so much anymore. That's why it doesn't even pay to clean this thing. One more day out here and it's right back to the way it was looking. So it's like, screw it. Just let it get dirty for the whole year and then clean it once at the end of the year before I put it away. Ooh. Hey. Oh, dude. Oh, yeah. You know what that is? Yes, is. Oh, I'm pulling something all of a sudden. Yeah, I just grabbed something too. I gotta get us out of this current. What do I got here? Dude, no way. You got another I one? caught another wheel. And this has a little something going on. I know you were saying that that was like maybe a manual. Uh, yeah, a manual blade. push lawnmower. You just and caught another part of one. Gearing to it there, man. That's like, probably just like where like the handle part would go on to maybe. For sure, dude. Or the wheel. Maybe this is one of the wheels off of that. <laughs> right. And now that I think yeah. about it, hold on a second. I'm putting that on there, bro. Hold on, here. See if that would fit. It bolts right up. <laughs> it does, it fits too. That's you gotta be kidding dude. me. Look at that, you guys. Alex caught himself another part yeah. of the old push mower. Or what if this was like all farmland at once and this was like an old farming like machine or something? Right, I mean, that could explain yeah, it. Absolutely. There wasn't always so these super. big tall buildings here. <laughs> you guys, we are finding some absolutely killer stuff here today. Whoa, look at that. I caught me a big old horseshoe, but look at, there's still like the, what you call them in there, the bolts. Isn't that what goes inside the horse's hoof? That's kind of funky, you guys, holy cow. We caught a little bit of good luck. I think I got something on here. What the heck is this? Somebody's honking. Dude, I'm pulling something and it feels like real weird. Seriously, what is this? Am I pulling it or am I pulling us to it? I feel like I'm doing a little bit of both. I, seriously, wow. Uh-oh, I need to go slower. Oh no, it's slipping. Oh no, no, no. I'm gonna lose it. What happened? Something just came off. I think I just plucked this off of whatever that was, dude. Look at, what is it? Oh, oh, hey, look it. This is some kind of knob that's squishy. Like some kind of, some kind of knob. Yeah, yeah, some kind of crank. This is definitely a handle. You guys, that is super weird. I was feeling something really heavy down there. And now I just caught what is definitely a handle. That's squishy. This is definitely some kind of handle for something. I have no clue, but that is pretty cool looking. Like a oh yeah, look at that! Man. It's like an old you bowl or it, oh yeah, yeah like an old sure. teapot. And it's magnetic. just missing the bottom. Magnetic That's kind of cool. Teapot, man. What do you know? Huh? Dude. 
I'm playing with something down here. Oh, right there. Right there, nice and easy. Nice and easy. You got something too? We're doubled up. Yeah, for sure. What the heck do we got? Oh, I see something kind of. Whoa. Oh, ho, ho. what do you got? Um, perhaps a sign, I hope. So I was really hoping to see like a label, like a sign, but I just don't know. It's got a couple man. slots on there yeah, or something. For sure. Huh. Maybe that's where the attached to the pole. I don't know, dude. The door yeah, off or something. Kind maybe? of just seems like a sheet metal plate at this point. But what what did you do? Huh. Yeah, but check this out, you guys. And first of all, this piece here looks like the old bike sprocket. <laughs> Unreal. Alex has been pulling out tons sure. of bike parts. And look at this here. What is that? The, tire. the bike <laughs> tire itself. Like what the heck? I hooked that just right on the magnet. Did you? Sure, yeah. Weird. Yeah, sure. And then look at this one, you guys. I'm pretty sure this is some kind of pulley. Okay. I believe, yeah. maybe, maybe not. Then again, I don't really know. The more I'm looking at it, it's hard to tell. There's like some kind of disc inside of this little bracket piece. What the heck do you guys think that one is? Could be a pulley. Look at this one. Dude, ski or something. it's an ice skate. You are not. It's one oh, of them old so ice skates cool, that you you attach yeah. that to the bottom Absolutely of your shoe. Absolutely not a doubt about it, you guys. That is super. That cool. is crazy. Awesome fun, man. Too bad the booty's not on there yet. <laughs> like, do you think they like clipped on? Or, yep. Yeah. Oh, Some, oh, somehow, something okay. like that. You like super clip it onto cool, your man. shoe or something. You guys, look at this ice skate that Alex found. These things are so cool. <laughs> Oh, look at that, man. I caught me Ooh. the old pocket knife. <laughs> oh, what do you, dude, you think that's blood on there? <laughs> What if it is, man? Seriously, think about it. What if somebody was walking around in this river walk and they poke somebody up and then they toss this sucker in the river, dude? It sounds crazy, but you just never know. This looks like one of them push button ones. You push the button down here and the knife would fold in, but it's not working. So this thing must have been down there for quite a while, you guys. Look at this, bro. Got what do you got? The old hammerhead. Hammerhead? The old hammerhead shark. Oh, no oh, way. Oh, Check oh, it out. Oh, Holy cow, you ain't building no houses with that oh, bad boy no more. You ain't doing nothing with this. <laughs> Unreal. There's actually like a hole inside of there. Like it's hollow. So, there was a worm living in there. <laughs> <laughs> That's crazy. That's crazy. Super <laughs> so much easier to do this when it's not raining. <laughs> uh, I think I'm pulling something up here, you guys. A little something. Hey, look at that. What is that? Is that, that's gotta be some kind of funky looking wrench. It's like a, a two headed wrench, like two different sizes, ain't it? I don't really know what that is. It sure looks like it. Oh yeah, and then there's like a little hook piece at the bottom. What, uh, is this an old, no, like a, or maybe a can opener, but I was gonna say like an old school barrel opener. Like some barrels, this is like the key part you put into a barrel and use that to open. I don't know, maybe not the old barrel wrench. Who knows, you guys? Oh, what the heck is this? Hey, dude, I just caught me a bike peg, but mine's not neon green. Still, all these bike parts, the tire, everything. Super, super small piece of chain. A, a piece of bike chain. Everywhere, man. And yet no bike.
I don't know what that is. It feels so weird. There's something down there. Something big and awkward. See, I was going to say, it felt like I was pulling on chain. And now look it, I just pulled something off of something else down there again. And it's got part of a chain on there. What do you think this is coming off of? I'm telling you, dude, there is something down there right in this area. I keep tossing trying to figure it out, but I can't quite figure it out. Huh. I just landed on something. Dude, I'm telling you, there is something right in here. We gotta figure out what this is. We got to. We have to. I keep clicking it. It's right in here. It's literally right here. Whatever it is, you can only get it up so much and then it comes off. Here it comes. Oh my gosh, it's actually coming up, yo. Dude, I got it. Oh my gosh, this is heavy. This should not be coming up, I'm telling you. I must have it wedged because whatever this is, is way too heavy for the magnet. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. What is that? No! No! Oh, that's so close, man. No. You gotta it, be kidding me. A for effort at least, dude. You had that. Could you see it yes, at it least? Looked, it was big. I don't know. It looked. I couldn't hardly see it. it I, all I know is that I was big. Ah. Boink, I just stuck real hard onto something. Come here. Come here. Dude, oh, oh my gosh. I bet you this is the thing I had on before. Here it comes. If I can get it up, dude. Oh my, why is it so heavy? Uh, oh my God. What the? Oh, oh, it's slipping again. As soon as it comes up out of the water, I start losing it. Ah. Oh my gosh. Oh, what the heck oh. is that? <laughs> what the? Armor off a battle it's tank. a it's oh, tank yeah. armor. <laughs> <laughs> you guys, look at this ridiculous thing. What the heck does the front side look like? Oh, whoa. Like decorative. Dude, look yeah. it, there's like a design on there. What do you think that is? It's like tentacles or maybe that's hair? I can't really tell, some kind of design, dude. Holy cow, that's like some kind of pedestal off of something. Oh my goodness, I'm gonna smack my head here, jeez. That is really cool, it looked like just a big old piece of ugly junk from the other side, man. But uh, that side looks really cool. I don't know what to think of that. Maybe it almost looks like part of a statue, dude. <laughs> like seriously, like the front part of a statue. I don't know. Does that maybe have writing on it or something? I don't think so. I don't see any. Maybe under the rust. Holy cow. I don't think we could fit much more on this boat. Look at, I mean, we are seriously leaning. Tons of old cool stuff. Lots of history in here, you guys. Absolutely unreal. And there's no telling what else could be in here. All right, guys, we do have some super, super dark clouds rolling in and we looked at the radar and it's about to get ugly. So we're going to buzz back to the boat launch. I'll let you guys watch us unload all this stuff into the back of the truck. But we got gotta hurry. Woo wee, this sucker is just about full, man. You guys we got the boat off the river we got everything packed up into the truck and that is gonna wrap our video up here for today another absolutely crazy day today you guys i hope you guys are loving this boat man because i just cannot get enough of it every time we take this thing out you can almost guarantee we're gonna find some seriously old seriously cool stuff but those clouds are starting to roll in and it's about to get really ugly
All right, guys, we stopped back at the boat launch. We picked Alex up, and he is also going to be throwing a 360-degree magnet. If you would like to check out his channel, I will leave a link down in the description. As you guys can tell, we moved to a new spot. We are right downtown in the heart of this city, and right up here is a big, long river walk. So we're going to start tossing around here. We're going to keep buzzing around with the trolling motor, and we're going to see what else we can find here today. I just stuck to something real good. Oh, here we go. It's coming up. Oh, here we go. Whoa. What is this? First find back here. Whoa. Dude, what is this? Oh, is that like some kind of basket or something? What the heck is this, you guys? Hold on a second. Let me uh, dump all this stuff out of here, man. What the? Oh, look at that. Is that some kind of basket? Look at there's like uh, holes in it up at the top there. I don't know. What the heck do you guys think that is? Whoa, there's a red on the bottom. Is that my blood or something? <laughs> look at, there's like definitely red on there. Oh, it's like fresh too. I don't know what's going on there. I don't think I'm bleeding. That is weird. It kind of is shaped like a bell. I didn't realize that. Alex pointed out there's a little slot in the bottom there. And it's got holes up at the top. What the heck do you guys think this thing is? Pretty cool, you guys. I don't know what the heck to think of that thing. We got us the old pot looking bell piece. Super cool, man. It looks like a machete plate or something, but I don't really know that. Oh, something. You guys, I just plucked something up out of the mud again. What do we got this time? Ooh, look at that one. Looks like some kind of bracket piece, maybe off of this wall and doesn't really look like it. Huh, who knows what that thing came from, but definitely some kind of bracket piece with the bolts on there. All right, you guys, a little bit of scrap metal cash money with the bolts on there. When it comes to scrap weight, you guys, this is some epic cash money. What did you say? Oh, look it, I see bubbles. See those bubbles? What the heck is this? Oh, oh, oh. Something here. Let's see if we can wiggle it. Oh, it's coming loose. Oh, here it comes. I got it. I love that feeling. What do we got here? Oh, yo. Do you know what that is? Whoa. Whoa, what is that? At first I was gonna say it kind of looked like a rim, like a old old buggy rim or wheel or something, but is it just all bent up? Maybe that is what it is or what is that? Thing sure does look funky. I don't know what to think of that. Huh. Oh, something here. I think I just plucked it up out of the mud, baby. The old mud pit. Oh, 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 another container. What is that? Whoa, it almost looks like two halves of something stuck together. If you look on the inside, you can almost see it looks like some kind of spring or some kind of coil in there. I can't really tell. And then look at that, there's like two little what the heck, two little holes on the top? What do you think that is, you guys? That's kind of crazy looking. Maybe some kind of super old school oil filter? I have no idea. And if this is an oil filter, off of what? Look at this. 
kind of what the heck like, is that? It's like a big canister or something. It kind of looks like a fuel filter, judging from- A fuel filter? Yeah, fuel from those uh, small ports in the top, like you'd have one going in, one going out. Huh. Uh, maybe for like a diesel or something, because this is big. Huh, that is crazy, man. I'm telling you guys, there is some pretty cool stuff in here. And most of it is super old. What do you got? Blue. Whoa! Yeah, like a oh, the, what the heck is that? Seat, I think, bro. Hey! Old, old Yo! That is, it is a you banana. Frame banana bike found? seat. That frame that you found that we were joking, like, oh, this is like the prototype of a bike. That's probably the seat to it, man. Like, I don't that remember. looks old. You don't remember that? No. Oh, I just stuck to something good. Hold on a second. Let's see if we can get this thing to wiggle up out of the mud. Oh, here it comes. He hopped. What is this? Oh, this might be the heaviest thing yet today, dude. What the heck is this? Yo! Nah, -uh, man. You guys, it's another one of these exact same type of things that I caught that I said looked like a bell or maybe some kind of little garbage bin. I don't know what the heck this is, dude. But now we caught a second one, you guys. What on earth? Remember the last one of these that I caught? Yeah, man, that's, but look, that stinks about my look at here, this one does one? not have a slot oh, in the bottom man. like the other one. So that I'm guessing they're not supposed to have a slot. We could cook us up some river stew. Well, I got something. Something with a little weight. We just sucked up out of the mud and I see bubbles coming up too. See those bubbles? Oh yeah. What the heck do we got here? Oh, 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 almost fell forward. Yo, look at what I just found, dude. I found me an old school iron. I'm pretty sure they're called sad iron. You're supposed to set this thing on some kind of hot surface to heat it up. And then you can kind of still see the handle on there. It's all bent and deformed a little bit. But I don't know what this piece on the back is. Is that for like smoothing out the clothes? I don't really know. I've never seen that on one of them. Talk about history, you guys. I mean, we're going back before electricity with these suckers. Heck yeah, you guys. Now that is a super cool find. Here we go, here we go. Oh, I was playing with something for a second. What happened? Come on, where'd you go? Oh, right there. Here it comes. Nice and easy. Heck yeah, dude. I'm like back to back right now. I am killing it. Oh, whoa. What is that, dude? Yo. What on planet Earth is this, you guys? Look at that thing, it's like some kind of cone, but it's got like holes in the top for maybe ventilation? What the heck do you think that is? Super cool, you guys. Oh, man. Careful. Yes. Oh, there it is. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Get her in there. <laughs> Holy cow. Whoa. Dude, it looks fresh. It looks pretty fresh oh, yet. Check that thing out, you guys. And where it was, holy cow, man. I mean, we they had to have rolled that thing straight off of there. Whoa! You could almost pump these tires up, hit it with the pressure washer, and that sucker would be brand new. I'm not even kidding. It couldn't have been down there too long. Definitely not as long as most of this stuff. I think there's a little fishing lure stuff. Oh, yeah, I do see some green. Spin the tire that way. Is it? Dude, it is. Oh, it's a good one. Oh, it is. That's a nice, expensive lure. That's a rip and wrap. Is it really? Yeah, that's like the eight dollar lures, dude. Heck yeah, man. There we go. Look at the shine. Heck yeah, on you guys. That. Look it's at got that some thing. Sparkles to it. That is a really nice. That's one. a really nice box. one. What do you think? He, he probably casted that one yeah, time and got right. it snagged on that bike. Oh. <laughs> 
You guys, look at this gigantic sledgehammer that Alex found. It's still got part of the wood handle on there and everything. What the heck you think they were using something like that for? That is unreal. I mean, that is massive. That's like the size of my head almost. <laughs> right? Yeah, dude. That's what that is. That's cool. Right? That's crazy. What a find. Unreal. Tink, 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 tink. You guys, look at this cart, man. We got stuff overflowing onto the boat. This is absolutely ridiculous. Can't even, can't even grab a boat too, right? I know, you can't. <laughs> there has not been a single time yet where we came on the boat and did not fill this cart to the top. What is going on today, guys? It is an absolutely beautiful day out. I already got the boat in the river, and today we're gonna be doing some more magnet fishing. In some of my recent videos, we've been out on this river, and we have been absolutely killing it, you guys. We've been filling this cart up to the top every single time we head out. But we do not have long, you guys. That sun is slowly starting to go down behind us, so we gotta hurry up and get right down to it. I'm gonna hop on the boat, we're gonna buzz down the river, and we're gonna see if we can find anything here today. All right, guys, check it out. We are back at this big old city river walk that me and Alex have been hitting in a couple previous videos. And today I have my large 360 degree magnet with me. We're gonna start here. We're just gonna move down the river walk. We're gonna dip our magnet around and we're gonna see what we can find here today. Oh. I just stuck something good right there and it's coming up literally first throw over here in this corner. What the heck do we got? Oh, I got to watch out for that pole. Oh my gosh. We're going to hit that pole. We're going to hit the 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 pole. Oh, that was close. You guys, I missed that pole by like an inch. All right. I got something here. If I can get it up. Buttercup. What's she going to be? What is that? Just the old crayfish hotel, I think so. We'll check that one out, you guys. Definitely nothing too fancy there. Looks like just the old scrap pipe. Oh, here we go. Something again. Holy cow. Back to back here, two for two. If we can get this one up. Oh, I see color. Oh, what is this? Yo, what the heck is that? Hold on a second. Dude, I don't know what the heck this is. Hold on. First of all, what's all in here? Looks like a glass bottle. Whoa, look at this glass bottle. Hold on. Let me, let me wash this out. Look at this thing. Look at that, you guys. What the heck do you think that was? That looks pretty cool. That little neck on there. I don't know how old this could be. Oh, look at it. It says something on there. Oh, it says method. Look at that. What the heck is that? The old method bottle. Oh, and then it says something else over here, but it's cracked, so I can't really read what the rest of it says. Now, what the heck is this? I want to shake this out, but honestly, I don't want to lose anything else cool that might be stuck in here. Let's do some digging first. What is that? Just a rock? Another rock. Not seeing nothing too fancy in there. All right, let me go ahead and dump all this mud out. Let me rinse this thing off. Check this thing out, you guys. Look at that teal color. What the heck do you think that even is, man? Is that some kind of old school gravy pourer? Look at it. It looks like it's got a nozzle on there. What the heck is this, man? That's kind of cool. Almost looks like a tiny helmet. That is really weird, you guys. I don't know what that could be. Super cool find, man. You guys, we got to toss this thing as fast as we can because it doesn't really look like it, but that sun is going to be going down real quick. There's something right here stuck in the mud and it's in the mud good. Come on, I gotta play the wiggle game. You gotta wiggle that sucker out of there, come on. I know you want to. 
I know you wanna. Just do it. Just do it, dude. Here it comes. Yes! Oh, that one took a minute. That took a minute to wiggle out of the mud. This sucker must have been down there for a long time. A long time. What is this? Whoa. Whoa. What the? Yo. Oh. Do you hear that? Sounded like it was gonna explode for a second. It's releasing the pressure. What the heck do you guys think that thing is? Obviously it looks like some kind of table or chair stand for sure. It's gotta be. Chair stand, who am I kidding? This is definitely for a table. X marks the spot. Check that one out you guys, holy smokes. What the heck was that? Boom, I swear to you, I just landed right on top of it. Am I a professional or am I a professional? Here we go. <laughs> you guys, heck yeah. What is this? Oh my gosh. Whoa, that's, what the heck is that, yo? Oh, I see some orange. Oh, no way. Look at what it is. Holy cow, it's one of them road construction signs. You guys, check this one out. You can still see some of the orange stripes on there and this one has the flasher on top of it. How long you think that sucker's been down there? Oh my goodness. This thing is super beat up. Oh, something. Yeah, and it's coming with us. What do we got here, man? We are seriously on fire in this area. What the heck, man? It's like nonstop. Whoa. Whoa, whoa, hold on a second. Is this some kind of wrench? Look at that. I don't think I've ever seen a wrench looking like that. It might be all bent up or something. But look at that. What do you think that is? It's like some kind of crimpers or something i don't know huh that is a funky one man oh i thought there was something on there check that thing out what the heck do you think that is? Part of a, maybe part of a dolly or something? Or hey, is that the front end of a shopping cart? I think that might be what that is, you guys. Look, it's kind of shiny under there. I think that's what that is. And then your wheels would go like right here. The old shopping cart front end. We just clicked something good there. Oh, come on. Oh, that's coming up. No, it's not. What the heck? Oh, there it is again. Let's see if I can wiggle this out of the mud. Come on, there's definitely something right there. Come on. Oh, here it comes. I got it. Heck yeah, dude. Man, I just can't get enough of this boat, you guys. The places we can hit are just insane. We can go anywhere. What the heck do we got this time? Whoa, whoa, man. Look at that funky gear looking piece. I've never seen something like that before. All I know is that is definitely some kind of gear piece. What the heck do you guys think that one plugged onto? Huh, that's pretty cool. Oh, what is that? That's something. And I did not feel that one click. It's so weird when that happens. It's rare that I just don't feel something click. It just gets heavy. What the heck are we pulling? Something on there. What the heck is this, man? Hey. Oh, 
You know what I think this is? Cause look at, I can see the wooden handle that's dwindled right down here. Look at, I think this is the backside of like probably a shovel. The shovel head would sit right here, you guys. It looks like it rusted right off. Oh my goodness. Kind of feels like we're sucking something up out of the mud here, guys. Heck yeah. Something coming up and that one feels weird, man. I didn't really feel it click. It just feels like we grabbed it. What the heck is this gonna be? That's, that feels weird. Oh, look it. No way, man. You have got to be kidding me. You guys, we found another one of these wheel looking things. I don't even know how many we found out here now. It's gotta be five or more for sure. And they all look different, man. I don't know if that's a wheel or is that some kind of steering wheel? If it is some kind of wheel, what the heck do you think that thing goes to? I have no clue. If you remember, we did find a couple push mowers in here, them old school push mowers. So I don't know if maybe these wheels would go to something like that I think we might have a little something on here you guys that Sun is going down quick man we do not have long at all here something on here though There is some, oh, what is that? Yo, what the, is that a doorknob? You guys, what in the world? I'm pretty sure this here is like the front wheel part of a bike, like in here is where the wheel goes. But look at this thing, man. I'm pretty sure this is an old doorknob. What kind of material is that? Is that what's magnetic? I don't think so. Maybe, oh, I can't really tell. Or is it just the bolt? Huh. That is crazy, dude. You guys, at first I thought this was like an AirPod case or something. I didn't know what the heck to think of that. The old doorknob. All right, you guys, that is gonna wrap our video up here for today. That sunset is absolutely gorgeous. Look at that. You guys, once again, man, we filled this cart right up. Definitely not over full, but again, we found some more super cool stuff. It just never fails to amaze me the things we find, you guys. Most of it is super old and almost all of it is really cool. What is going on today, guys? Today, we are back out on the boat. We're dodging some clouds today. It was just raining. But today, we're gonna be doing some more magnet fishing here next to this river walk that we haven't been to for quite a few months now. The last time we were here, it was the beginning of summer, and now we're like coming into fall pretty soon. But if you remember the last times we were here, holy cow, you guys, there is some cool stuff in here. There's tons of apartment buildings. There's tons of bars and businesses along this river walk. As always, there is just no telling what we're gonna find. Let's get right down to it, start dipping this magnet around and let's see what we can find here today. All right guys, we are back out here today. I got my large 360 degree magnet with me. Now the last time we were here, they did not have in these docks and it looks like also a kayak launch. Let's get right down to it. Let's start tossing around and let's see what we can find today. Ooh, something smells good. Oh, what's that? Oh, we're grabbing something here. Ooh, that's kind of heavy. Yeah, what is that? Oh, it's slipping. Don't slip. It's so deep in here, dude. Yeah, what do we got here? What the heck is that? Looks like the ugly pipe or something. We call us a piece of plumbing. And actually, I don't know if this is actually just a pipe or this might be some kind of fence post or something. You can see like some, some uh, latches on there or something.
Here we go. Pulling something up out of the mud. For sure, yes. Stay on there. We got here. Oh, it's so deep in here, dude. Oh, is that a signpost? Oh, you guys, these things always fool me. The old signposts look alike, but then when you get to the end of it, it's just a T-post. And look at all the rust on that sucker. Holy cow, this one's been down there forever. Probably since uh, all of this was farmland around here. Who knows? You know what I just thought about? I'm actually gonna tie the boat off to the dock and we're just gonna jump off and magnet fish from the dock. There's something down here that does not want to come up. Boop. I think I got it. Oh my gosh, it's actually coming up. You guys have been trying to pluck this out of the mud for like two minutes. That's pretty heavy. Whatever this was, or whatever this is, has been down there for a while. Yeah, what do we got here? Whoa, dude. No, I've literally found one of these before. I, I want to say not even that long ago. Is this not another um, well pump? That's like exactly what that is. Look at, you can see the pump on there with the spout. Dude, I'm pretty sure I still have the other one too. This is like almost identical. That's way too cool. And I'm pretty sure I kept the other one. So now we got two of these suckers. Pump you some water. This water's got like a film on it. It's nasty. Oh, <laughs> <I did. coughs> oh, something hanging off of there. What is that? Oh, you guys, at first I thought it was some kind of gear piece, but I think this is like the guard for some kind of bike chain. And being right next to this river walk, I would assume there's probably a couple bikes down there. We just gotta find them. Something there. Oh, what do we got here? Is that going to come up or no? Yeah, we got something here, you guys. That's, that feels very heavy. Is this the bike to, to the sprocket that we just found? It might be, man. This is heavy. Whoa. No, that's not a bike. Look at what this is, dude. <laughs> you guys, oh, I almost dropped it. Look at what we got. The old sea chair. Holy cow, man. Look at all the zebra mussels on this thing. They're thick on there. Oh my goodness. How long you think that sucker was down there? I don't see any fishing lures, nothing. We got Rob. She's a little dirty, but if you took a power washer to it, this could be a brand new chair. And I'd be willing to bet it probably came from one of these restaurants. Somebody got in the old bar fight and they used the chair. That's crazy, you guys. Let's keep tossing and see what else is in here. Oh, what is that? Some kind of white wire or something. It almost looks electrical. Oh, you know what that is? That's, I'm pretty sure that's a brake cable off of a bike. Well, there's gotta be the bike down there somewhere. See, now I actually cannot even get the boat into this area right here now that they have the docks up. So this is the only way to magnet fish this area now. Oh, here we go. Something there. And if it's like the last big heavy thing, it's probably super stuck in the mud, you guys. I'm sure a lot of this stuff's been down there forever. Let's see if we can even get it out. Whatever that is does not want to come. It's like slipping. Ooh, that slapped even harder. Oh, and we popped right off. I don't know what that was. Oh, 
Oh, look it. Now we got a third piece. We got a piece of the bike chain. And I keep clicking on to something, so I don't know if we're just, obviously we must be pulling pieces off of the bike itself. Oh, look that, look at that, you guys. We caught us a teeny tiny horseshoe. Most of the ones I find, I wanna say, are way bigger than my hand, but this sucker fits right in my hand. Pretty cool, you guys, and I still see some of the nails that go through the hoof. We caught us a little bit of good luck. look at that on there is that a can yeah whoa what is that see a little purple what does it say canada dry i think so but why does it look like there's grapes on there like it's the old grape soda yeah look at grape on the back the old grape canada dry i didn't even think they had those well that's pretty funky you guys and the fact that it's magnetic means that sucker is old you ain't drinking that one no more Oh, look at that, you guys. I All I seen was just a bunch of scrap from this side, but I flipped it over. Check it out. We got the old rail back. Stick your tongue on that bad boy. Oh, we're missing one of the prongs. You can't even. You're in luck. Bzz. No way, you guys. We caught us another battery. The old double A, but look at this one actually has a date, December 2025. So this one is not that old. And check this out. We had some kind of like, this is like a trailer locking pin. You stick this in your trailer and lock it on there so it doesn't come off. I wish these docks weren't here. It's covering up like most of what seems like would probably be the juicy area. Ooh, I grabbed something. You guys, I literally see bubbles coming up down there, like 20 feet away. That's, I don't know what's going on here. <laughs> Either it's a super long pipe or something, but I see oil coming up. Not even kidding you. Nice and super slow with this one. I really don't want this to fall off. I see more oil. Do you guys see that? There's like an oil film on top of the water. It's so deep. Why? Here we go. Here it is. Dude, no way. That shouldn't even, no, this is not what oil's coming from, but look at, ha <laughs> You guys, check it out. We cost the old BMXer. No way. I swear to you, yep, I thought the tires are still pumped, both of them. Are you kidding me? Could I ride this thing? <laughs> Dude, there's no way right now. All right, all right. Oh, we don't have brakes. We don't got brakes. Kent something, Rampage. Kent number 18, isn't that like a race car driver? Definitely the old kid's BMX bike and it's still got the pegs on the back. Again, this is probably something you could really just take a pressure washer to and scrub down, clean up, and it would probably be good to go. Now, if you look, this chain is still intact and this still has the, the sprocket guard on there. So this bike has nothing to do at all with the other bike pieces that we found. So there's gotta be more in there. Here we go. Is this one gonna come up? Oh, I think so. Yeah, here it comes. This one's actually pretty heavy. 
Holy smokes, look at a whole bunch of bubbles. Yep. Yeah, what do we got here? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> no way. Another one. Oh, oh. You got it? Oh, I got it. I got it. There we go. Holy cow. Another one. There's got to be a couple of these suckers in there. Yeah, you ain't riding that one, that's for sure. <laughs> Holy cow. <laughs> I don't know what the brand on that one is. Can't even see it. We got something. That sucker feels pretty heavy. Ooh, that's like almost heavier than a bike, I want to say. Wow, that's actually really heavy. What is this? Of course, it's got to be 500 feet deep. Hmm. Oh, we're hitting the bottom of the... It is another bike. Oh, my gosh. Like this is crazy. Yeah, this one feels like a mountain bike or something. Oh, oh get up here. Got it. I got it. We got any fishing lures snagged in this one? Some cash money? I don't think so. I don't see any fishing lures. Oh, wait a minute. I see some line. Oh, I see a lure right there. Hold on a second. Got it. Check that one out. Look at the colors on that one. Purple and gold with a pink nose. Unbelievable. And again, I can't even tell what the brand is on that thing. Check it out, you guys. We got another bike and this one just like the last one is not even close to rideable absolutely unreal there's got to be tons of them suckers in there i'm surprised we only had one fishing lure though three bikes now and only one lure that's kind of crazy and as long as these bikes have been down here must mean that uh, not many people fish here apparently pretty cool you guys this is probably like a four dollar fishing lure and she rattles nice Well, you started over there by your boat. Yeah, yeah. And working yourself out of the way. Yeah. How are you going? So I don't know. I'm not sure. If it starts raining on me, probably not too much farther. I think I got something again. This is definitely not as heavy as another bike, I don't think. But it still feels pretty heavy. A shopping cart? Oh, part of one. <laughs> yup, look at that. We caught the side of the shopping cart and the handle. We could do some shopping over at the mall. It is starting to sprinkle, you guys. I was hoping it wasn't gonna rain, but we're not getting so lucky. Ooh, I think I just pulled something out of the mud. Yes, stay on there. Yeah, ooh, I see a little blue. Whoa, first of all, you guys, yep, look at, I definitely seen the blue on there. That sucker looks fresh. Something like this is definitely nice to keep on the boat just cause. What does that say on there? Helping hand. But look at this big old piece of cable wire here. Who knows what that one came off of. It's all frayed at the end, nothing fancy. Oh, here we go. Something plucked it right up out of the mud. What do we got here? Why does that feel so heavy, huh? I didn't even see that on there. It looks like, oh, ooh. dude, is that a necklace or somebody's chain? You gotta be kidding me. Hold on, first of all, I seen this piece of pipe on there and that is what was heavy. A whole bunch of nothing too fancy with that. But you guys, maybe a smushed can on there. Look at, is that a, oh, it's not a necklace, that's a bracelet. Dude, 
dude, that's pretty cool, man. I can't tell if it's like, obviously real gold is not magnetic, but I think maybe this could be gold plated. I don't really think it looks very gold anymore. I'm sure after being down there for who knows how long, it's probably not gold anymore. Still super cool, you guys. We found us what could be like a gold plated bracelet. I wonder how much something like that would be worth if it was gold plated. And could you get it replated? I don't know how that works. Pretty cool, man. Now this little walkway dock, I don't know if this one comes in and out during the, the winter also. I have no clue, you guys, but this one I can totally Toss right under. Oh, I just pulled something out of the mud again, man. Almost everything has to be plucked out of the mud around here. That's how you know everything's been down there forever. Yeah, what do we got here? Whoa! What the heck is that frisbee disc looking piece? I don't know what to think of this one. That's definitely a big old heavy chunk of steel. Otherwise I would have thought maybe this was like a pot lid or something, but I don't think that's what that is. This thing is heavy. You guys look, it, it, you can just see how foggy it is. It looks foggy, but that's mist. It's like a misty rain and there is storms on their way. So we gotta keep moving here. Go back under. Did I just land right on something? I sure did. Is it gonna come up too? It is. Wow, that's heavy. Ooh, what is this? Oh, is this a fourth bike? <laughs> no. Whoa, that's not, that's gonna slip off. Hold on a sec. Um, oh, I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it. Oh, Ooh, what the heck is that? Um, dude, looks like some kind of vent or something here. And is that like the bottom tube piece here? Oh, wait a minute. Whoa. You guys look at the bottom of that thing. What the heck does that say? There's definitely some writing on there. There's some weird stuff in here. Oh, is that another can? It sure is. Look at that one though, super beat up. You can hardly even read the words on there. What does that say, laboratory? What the heck, I don't know if I drink that one. Honestly, I don't know what that even is. You can't even hardly tell. Here we go. I grabbed me up something, snatched it. She's mine now, bucko. What the heck is that? Oh, you know what this is? You guys, at first I thought this was like the, the pusher part for like a dolly, but no, I'm pretty sure this is the front part of a shopping cart. This is like the bottom nose part. I think the wheels would actually go right here. Wow, not much left of that one. Ain't doing no shopping there. Look at that, man. Wait a minute. Is that just half of one? I think so, you guys. Look at that. That sucker was snapped clean in half. It almost looks like it was cut. 15 sixteenths. Er, er, er. Now we got the wrench and the screwdriver. We're starting us our own toolbox. Wow, you guys, it is really starting to rain. I mean, look at that. I'm basically just standing out here in the rain at this point. It was sprinkling. It was a little misty. Now it's like pretty much full on raining, buckle. Oh, this might not be good. I might actually have to get out of here. Not good. Cause I don't think it's gonna stop. I think it's actually supposed to get worse. This might be our last throw here, you guys, but I do have something. I shall do. Couple something, what the heck are you got going on there? Yeah, what the heck is that? Looks like this piece here, is that even magnetic? 
Uh, no, definitely not. That's not even magnetic. I don't know what that is. Some kind of trimming piece or something. But we caught this piece here, which the more you look at it, you guys look at it, it's the front forks pieces off of a, like a bike. Wow, there's literally nothing left of that one. You almost can't even tell that that came off of a bike. It just disintegrated. Look at this thing. What the heck, you guys? At first, I thought this was another horseshoe, but uh, no, I think this is some kind of plastic or rubber handle. Yeah, and we caught it by like this metal clip. What the heck do you think that came off of? Like a, oh, maybe a suitcase, dude? Uh -huh. Yeah, maybe, because this is like, that's like leather or something. Maybe rubber, I don't really know. Maybe an old purse or a bag? There could be a whole bag down there full of who knows what. Oh, look at that. What the heck is that? Some kind of key? Yeah, look at that thing, you guys. That definitely looks like a key to me, man. But for what? I have no clue. Is that to start a car or open a some kind of treasure chest? I have no clue. I definitely should have left a long time ago. I'm soaked, man. If you enjoyed this video, please make sure to hit that thumbs up button for me and don't forget to subscribe.